I am an expat and it is music that brought me to this wonderful country and as it turns out, it was a fabulous decision. After all, this is the land of opportunity. I get to play music for a living, I get to present television shows and I get to enjoy Amsterdam and all the other wonderful cities that are in the Netherlands. But being an expat in the Netherlands does have its challenges. Of course, the Dutch do have some rather strange habits, especially when talking about food. They like to eat at six o'clock sharp, mash everything up, and then there's a really weird one, the raw herring, which they eat upside down and sprinkle with raw onions, probably to cover up the taste. Oh, and by the way, there's of course their favorite form of transportation, the bike. When I first wanted to buy a house in the Netherlands, I realized that I was completely out of my depth. I mean, it's a financial jungle out there. But luckily, I bumped into an expat friend of mine who recommended me to expat mortgages. Within, like, the first phone call, I knew that I was in safe hands. They were going to take me through the whole process from the very start to the very end, through the financial bit, of course, the finding the mortgage, the tax bit, the notary bit, from the start to the very end, they were always there to pick up the phone and answer my stupid questions whenever I wanted, at weekends, at night, and they were there physically during the signing of all the papers and translated and made me calm and understand what is really a very, very difficult process if you don't have experts like that on hand. The great thing about expat mortgages, though, is they're not paid by the banks, so they're completely unbiased and completely fair, and they will simply find whatever product is best for you. And that, I guess, is why they're the number one expat mortgage company in the whole country. I highly recommend them. Is there anyone here that can translate this for me? Lauer Weifenfried. And you know, those clever guys at Expat Mortgages have even got their own YouTube channel, which has got loads of footage explaining everything you need to know about buying a house, financing a house, and everything. So if there's nothing on TV, and you've got nothing better to do, then my suggestion is you follow this link.